What's going on my fellow Duelist Architecture here with a brand new Duelist video for you guys. Today I'm going to talk about some ideas I have for just making Duelist more fun. I made a video a long time ago, it's one of the earliest videos I made for Duel Links. But I mentioned that Duel Links just lacks fun. And I was thinking myself like, I play this game daily. I love Yu-Gi-Oh! I've been playing Yu-Gi-Oh! since the card game first came out. Um, so what I was thinking myself like, instead of just sitting here complaining non-stop about why Duel Links isn't fun, Make a video talk about what Konami could do to make the game fun. And so what I came up with was adding another PvP um, category. A permanent one. Because usually they'll, they'll do like a PvP thing. It'll be like a temporary thing like uh, the World World Championships, um, Kyber, the KC Cup. Um, every now and then it'd be like little special duels and dual carnival and things like that. But I was thinking they should add a permanent uh, PvP um, mode. And the one I was thinking of is um, anime decks, um, and, and like basically you don't have to call it anime decks, but you can you can just call it you know legendary decks or character decks. But essentially the idea is you have a game mode where people can only play character decks, but the requirement is you have to have at least one of every main card, main mousetrap card that that deck uses. You know, and what that it excludes all structure decks. Basically, what I want this game mode to be is a game mode that allows people to play character decks without having to play against the meta. Because last time they did a, a legendary uh, deck little mini thing, they had like a little mini event where, you, where they had a legendary decks. People just they would just use like three cards from a character and then just put sub terrors into that deck. They use three cards from a character and then put six sands into that deck. And if you didn't deal with that, you just you just dealt with ancient gears, blue eyes, red eyes, and, and what you call it? Um, got the other one. I had a, a huge brain fart. But anyways, you get you get the gist of it. You know, by by eliminating ex decks and structure decks, you you prevent dealing with neo fusion. You you prevent dealing with um, you know the blue eyes structure deck. You you prevent dealing with the red eyes structure deck. So what this would do is promote fun. Promote not having to deal with the meta because right now, everywhere you go in PvP for Duel Links is meta. You go to casual duels, you're playing against the meta. You go to PvP, for, you go to rank, dealing with the meta. You deal with any kind of special event, you're dealing with the meta. There's nowhere you can go in PvP for Duel Links where you can just have fun. And to me, character decks are fun as shit. I love playing character decks. That's why in this channel you see a lot of freaking Dark Edition decks. And right now you're watching Fortune Lady. Like, I'm, I'm literally playing Fortune Lady competitively. And not that Duel Links meta version of, of Fortune Lady where it's mostly a background kind of setting and then the big picture is get, getting out other cards. No. This is full blown uh, Carly Carmine Fortune Ladies. Not anything. There's no cheesy little gimmick to it. Just nothing but pure Fortune Lady. And that's fun to me. To me, that's what fun is. To me, fun in Yu Gi Oh! is playing character decks. I love it. I enjoy it. It's fun. I hate playing meta. I hate it. Like whenever I play meta, I don't have fun. I'm doing it because I'm trying to rank up. I'm not doing it because I'm, I'm enjoying myself. If I'm playing Ancient Gears or Red Eyes, I'm not having fun playing it. I'm only playing to level up or to rank up. But I love playing characters. I love playing Dark Magician. I love playing Tomb World. I love playing Fortune Lady. It's fun. So I feel like they should add a game mode, a permanent game mode where this is all you do. It's just play play character decks and make it to where you can't use EX decks. Because I want to have fun. And I feel like a lot of people will have fun too. I remember I was, on, I was on Facebook and I was looking at some of the people who were commenting on the Duel Links page. And people were talking about like they want to be able to play character decks, but they can't because all they did was meta. So it's like there's other people besides me who wants to play this game just to use character decks. Because character decks is fun. You know, I love the interactions that this game have with the characters. You know, if, if I pick Akiza and I'm going against Jack Atlas, those two, they, they have a, a back, back and forth conversation about, you know, an anime style. But yet, you go against Jack Atlas, he's playing blue eyes or red eyes. It's like, that's not fun. That interaction is not fun if, if you're playing a deck that, that Jack doesn't even, doesn't even use. It's more fun when it's literally playing out like how the anime would. Character decks are fun. And Konami needs that. 
Konami needs to add things to the game that just promotes fun. Now, Captain X isn't competitive. So if you add it, you're adding a game mode who's not, it's not going to be competitive at all. It's going to be super fun and people are going to have something that they want to do, which is play, you know, the decks that the characters provide. Now, what's the point of having these character events if the, the decks that these characters come with, no one plays them? Because it doesn't benefit you whatsoever to play the, those decks in, in, in a ranked. You add uh, Satorius, no one plays his, ar his arcane cars in freaking PvP. They're not that good. They're not. They're not competitive enough. But if you had a character game mode where people, where you're not dealing with, you know, the meta, people will start playing his cards. You like these events are useless if people don't play those cards. So having having a new game mode that you know is targeted towards promoting people playing character decks, it's a win-win for everybody. It'll be super fun and again make it permanent. It'd be a great. <clears throat> break any action from the, the competitiveness of PvP. I have fun with I, I, I would love to, to, to be able to play um, a Tim use Dark Magician against Arcana and he use also use Dark Magician. I'd love to play Joey using using like a Gear Freak Gear Freak cards. Or you know, you put in his main cards you get like Gear Freak, Red Eyes and Axe Swordsman. You know, playing Joey. I think it'd just be fun to just play character decks the way that the anime had those decks built. Just thought, you know, I, obviously people will probably disagree with it. People like, oh, just, that, that just sounds stupid. I don't, we don't need to do all that. We just do what we got. There's nothing wrong with the metal. The metal's fine. Nah, 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 nah. Like, and I just want to have fun. And I don't have fun with PvP. Do I win games? Yeah, I win. I'm always at least plat or higher when it comes to Duel Links. I don't have fun. I might grind my ass off and you know get to, to plat, get to legendary, or get to legend. But I don't have fun doing it because I'm playing meta. The meta's not fun to me. It's not. That's why you see tune, tunes on this on this channel now. Like early in when I was uploading Duel Links to this channel, you were seeing Red Eyes Ancient Gears. Now you're seeing Fortune Ladies and Dark Magicians and Tunes. Because that's what's fun. That's what's fun to me. I don't have fun playing the, other, the, the meta cards. It's not fun. Not, at, at this point, I don't even care if I win or lose anymore. Because I just want to play with these decks. But anyways, guys. This is for the video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy, leave any thoughts you have in the comments below. What do you think? Do you think they should add a permanent character deck uh, game mode PvP? What ideas would I do what you have to make Duel Links more fun? Again, leave all that in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.